Good evening, sir and madam. Welcome to La Telepathie. Have you dined with us before? No, this is our first time. We've heard great things. <laughs> the great things you've heard, madam, are quite correct. So can we see the menu? There are no manuals, I'm afraid. Are there any specials tonight? <laughs> Every dish is special, sir. You'll see, each meal is tailored to the innermost cravings of each specific diner. Our chefs monitor each customer's brain activity and create a culinary masterpiece based on their individual wishes. That's fantastic. So how do we order? No need to order, sir. Your minds have already informed our chef of the dish you desire. This is amazing. I wonder what we're gonna get. I'm so excited. I hope mine's made of chocolate or bacon or caviar. Me too. I can't wait to find out. Happy anniversary, sweetheart. Your chocolate caviar fountain with bacon crackers, madam. This looks amazing! And for you, sir, your dick. What in fuck's name is that? Your dinner, sir. Dicks. There, there must be some kind of mistake. I, I don't... Stephen, why did he bring you dicks? I, I don't know. Uh, this, this is not what I ordered. Sir, you were telepathically monitored, and this is most certainly the dish that your brain desired. My brain didn't desire this. We are a respectable establishment and can assure you that your brain specifically said... <clears throat> Ooh, I hope I get a big pile of dicks to put in my mouth. That would be so yummy wummy, sir. Well, I, I don't want it. This is a mix-up. Steven, you're making a scene. We cannot just replace the dicks you ordered because you changed your mind. Send it back and bring me something else right now. You're ruining our anniversary. I'm leaving. Have fun with your plate of dicks. I'll get your check, sir. Oh my god, that's so fucking good. Good morning, sweetheart. Good morning. Did you sleep well? I did. What are you cooking for breakfast? That smells heavenly. It's your favorite. I'm just cooking up your... Cock and balls, you cheating bastard! I'm sorry. Did you learn your lesson? Can I have some ketchup? Ah, what's for dinner, honey? Oh, you know, just your... Lying, cheating ass! Oh, hi. You didn't see me there. You know why? Because I'm Ted Bear. If you want to survive like me, you've got to have a sharp wit, endurance, good looks, and a backpack full of ingenuity. I've got mine on both straps. Try and keep up! Here's the scenario. You're on an international flight, and the best has gone dodgy. Perhaps an albatross with poor eyesight has confused your plane engine for a mate and smacks right into it. Macking up your one snug commute to a spiraling disaster catastrophe. Luckily, you've left your tray table up, and now you're the only survivor, stuck in some godforsaken jungle. It's cold, it's muddy, it's wet, it's hot, it's inconvenient, and it's a bugger out of the way. Now, the first thing you gotta do is get a sense of direction. A good strategy is to find the nearest river and follow it. After a while, all the walking will leave you bleed naked. You need to find a source of food, because food means carbohydrates. Carbohydrates mean energy. 
Energy means movement. Movement means survival. Luckily, there are bounties of food in the wilderness. You've just got to know where to look. <gasps> bacon! We must be underneath a bacon tree! Now, some of these aren't quite ready. You need to climb higher to find the crispy ones. Ah, now there's a nice ripe strip. You've got yourself a quarter of a complete breakfast right there. Time to keep moving. Try and keep up. Now, we need to find some refreshments to wash it down. Ah, what do we have here? Now, it's very crucial to reach all the way in the back to get the freshest milk. Always, always, always check the expiration date on the back. It's imperative to your survival. Ah, just my luck. Chocolate chip muffins. <coughs> Raisins. Here we are on some desert island, conceivably in the middle of the ocean. Without a map, we can't be sure. What we do know is that our body needs water. Not so fast, mate. This is salt water. We need to filter it into something more drinkable. Now the fruit fish turns salt water into delicious, drinkable punch. First, you need to find the fruit appendage. <laughs> <sighs> now you're probably thinking, Dad, there's no such thing as a fruit fish. Well, you're right. It's actually a crustacean. Yeah, the, the trick to uh, surviving on a, on a mountain, it's, uh, it's hard to catch your breath at this elevation. I'm gonna, I'm just gonna... Scrumptious? Uh, I'm actually pretty full. Tasty, huh? Yeah, what the fuck? Well, it looks like my time's about up. We hit to see you go, Pops. You've redeemed yourself in God's eyes. Now, are you sure about your last meal? I'm sure. I just want a mouthful of sweet, sweet corn. Any last words? <laughs> His last act 
It was truly a kindness. Boys, it's time for dinner. Uh, I, I hate, hate dinner. dinner. What about dinner in a tube? <laughs> oh, yeah. Right. Scrub a digest. Hunger tube. Introducing dinner on the go. It's got calcium. Hunger tube. It's scrub a -duchess. Warning, not actually scrub a -duchess. Whoa, whoa, what did you say? Uh, nothing. scrub a <laughs> Oh my god, are you okay? Somebody um, help! Is he gonna make it? I... I don't know. How... How is he? I'm sorry, boys. It looks like he's going to be in a coma for the rest of his life. Unconscious in bed, eating out of a tube. Some physicist. <gasps> that was just a reflex. And what can I get for you, sir? Straight coffee and make it quick. I'm sorry? Ah, excuse me. I can be a real jerk until I've had my coffee. Nobody move! I said nobody fucking move or I'll fucking end you! Put it all in the bag! No! I said now! Do it! No, 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 no! The beans! Put all the beans in the bag! <laughs> I'm sorry. I could be a real jerk until I get my coffee. Yeah, I need that coffee shit for brains! I need it! Stop! Please stop! Uh, you guys need your morning uh, coffee? No thanks. We already got ours. <laughs> I just love noodles! <laughs> Not as much as me, dude. Not as much as me. Oh yeah? I bet I love them even more. <laughs> okay then, how much do you love noodles? This much. And I... So how much do you love noodles? Oh my god! Hi, this is Rod's Thick Pizza. How do you want it? Hi there. I'm a real lonely girl. And I'm so hungry, I could take all the meat you have. Mm, I think we could do it for you. Would you perhaps like a spicy Mexican or a hot Italian sausage? Ooh, I'll take Italian with extra sausage. Now ma'am, you know we only do it deep. I'm so ready. Mmm, good. I'll be coming in 30 minutes. See you then. I'll be waiting. Hello, ma'am. Here's your pizza. And? And that'll be $12.95.